Welcome to the booth of Bunty Van Apples here at SIH 2014. I've heard that uh, the brand this year explored the universe, the world of stars, astrology and astronomy. So let's have a look. Bunty Van Apples time is uh, emotion and this year the emotion comes uh, first from the universe. Uh, it's about uh, poetic astronomy. Some years ago we have launched the Midnight in Paris uh, watch and the Jour Nuit watch. We developed this year 18 uh, extraordinary dials uh, presenting uh, constellation, uh, zodiac signs, uh, lucky stars and uh, one poetic complication which is the masterpiece uh, of the collection, the Midnight Planetarium. It is a planetarium. The idea with this planetarium was to create a watch that is really in the history of uh, the strong link between astronomy and watchmaking, but in our own poetic way. So you could say it's an astronomical watch. So of course, I did a watch. It gives the time. It's astronomical. So it also uh, displays six planets of the solar system that are going to evolve around the sun at the pace as they do in the universe. So th that's quite a striking technical achievement. And it's poetic. So what's poetic about this planetarium is that actually you have here a rotating bezel and a calendar. And the idea is that the wearer is able to project his own poetic lucky day in the universe. So you choose with the red arrow here. your lucky date and you can change it every day if you want. And then slowly you will see all the planets moving and you will see the Earth coming under the lucky engraved star and that's your lucky day. The inspiration has been here for a long time but specifically for this watch it took around three years to develop because underneath all this beautiful and jewelry-like dial you have a lot of technique. We worked with Van der Klo uh, to develop an exclusive new model. Uh, they are uh, from the Netherlands, they are specialists in astro astronomical watches. So they help us uh, develop this module that enables to calculate uh, the rotation of each planet. The movement is going to provide the hour and minute information and the model that they worked on is going to uh, calculate and interpret this information which is a very human information into an astral information which is the time of rotation for each planet. 88 days for Mercury and 29 years for Saturn. So this is quite complex actually.